Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. There's one thing that I wasn't telling people, and I think it's important I say it now, because I don't know if I'm the only one or if other women feel like this, but I was really hesitant to talk about how miserable I was during the first trimester because I almost felt this guilt of what if I couldn't have kids and I shouldn't be complaining, you know, and it, if I was in that position to where I couldn't get pregnant, I would definitely be going through all that and more. So I almost felt like I couldn't complain because this is such a gift that we're getting because I was honestly scared that I couldn't get pregnant because I know some people that have gone through that. So I almost hid the fact of how miserable I was and how hard it was and how, I mean, you're used to being sick, but you're just not used to feeling so sick for so long. You're like, I'm fine, I'm fine. You're throwing up and feeling really crappy. I love you. I love you too. Night. Good night. Pixie. I woke up at three in the morning and realized that I forgot to upload yesterday's vlog. It's there now. Then I couldn't get back to sleep for another hour or two. I've been up and down for a while. Oh, did you see that? No. It's your fault. You're distracting me with the camera. <laughs> Ew. Why are you on me? I am not your mother. Go look for your mother. This looks like you have gas. <laughs> Wait, was that the baby or you? Look how hard it breathes. You can see it when I stand down. Look, I'll show you. See, now it moves to the front. Mm-hmm. Your belly button needs tucked in, though. <laughs> My umbilical cord. Yeah, it's falling out. <laughs> <laughs> My head hurts today. It hurts up here. <laughs> That's good to know. Because <laughs> if it hurt anywhere else, both Pixie and I would be a little concerned. You know what I'm saying? Usually my headaches are back here or back towards my neck. But this time it's right up here. Well, Mount Vesuvius looks a little better today. I don't know if that's a bug bite or a pimple. Can I pop it? No, it's not poppable yet. Not even close. Anything is poppable. Okay, I don't want to pop it. Boundaries, hon. Boundaries. What yours is mine, and what mine is mine. So that's mine. <laughs> Do you want to pop it? Yeah. No. Can I build this? You know, it's been sitting there for at least a week, and I've been meaning to build it. Every day, wanting to build it, I've removed it from the box. And so, yes, it would be great if you could build this little set. Okay. I'll build it, and you can live through me. Pretend it's you. What's mine is yours. Yeah. And this is love. If you're letting me build your Lego. No, no, no. Lego is not what this is. These are bricks. Oh. Made... By the Lego group. Oh. Yeah. Oops, sorry. I'm to clarify that for you. If you're going to do it. So what do I say? Can I build your bricks? No, no, no. Can you assemble the bricks to <laughs> just <laughs> have at it? <laughs> Monday! And the first thing I see is a palm tree. It was meant to be. I know. I knew there was a reason I wanted to build it. We got construction happening all throughout the house today. Yeah. Good job. One problem. 
The cat is stuck in the tree. I know. See, he's here to rescue it, and she is so happy. He's going to rescue it with a fish. Mm-hmm. He's trying to get it down. Oh, so he throws the fish at the cat, knocks the cat off the tree, breaks the tree. And then gets in his car and jets off. Shh. He said we could just put a painting over it and we'll never notice. I'm just kidding. He's coming back tomorrow or Wednesday. What is this color? I would say... Green. Um, toasted olive dressing. No. Garlic toasted olive dressing. They had to punch a hole through the wall to be able to put this door back on track. I brought you some warm pizza. Even though I know you like it cold. You might be wondering why we have a bookshelf in the middle of our hallway here. It's because last night I was inspired. You might remember that we're going to be decorating the baby's room with dark furniture, which left us with a problem. What are we going to do with the birch stain wood furniture? And I thought, wait, we have birch stuff in our garage. So I'm going to be moving the birch furniture. What can I say? I like things to match. We're birch colored too. Does that mean we're going to be moving to the garage as well? No, Wicket. You can stay inside the house. Yay! We don't yet know what's going to be happening to the old 720p TV, though. It looks like a spine, but it's actually a hat rack that hangs over the back of a door that Diana wants me to get rid of. The spine, not a door. Thank you, Daniel Risk. He sent us a geek magnetic poetry kit with words like interface and cook. Cook isn't very geeky. Yeah, it is. It can be. Diana was neutral towards the geek magnets until I showed her that nachos are a part of the set. Always geeking can be complete as phasery nachos. Never name our galactic empire. Protect the stream. This is mine. I see you're pointing at the word evil <laughs> and war. Enjoyed. That's right. That's the sun. And look how beautiful it is. I'm still wearing a sweater, but... I'm not complaining. <laughs> it's really nice. I just picked up some sushi to go. I know Chris has been wanting sushi for a while, and so have I. But I grabbed some safe rolls, which is cooked fish mostly. It's not the same, but it'll do. I just avoid whatever is, you know, debatable, so. I'm avoiding pretty much everything <sighs> as I watch Chris eat his delicious salmon sashimi. <laughs> I also picked up the movie Frozen. We jumped on the bandwagon. We're finally going to see it. Even though we have free movie theater tickets, we don't want to go. Sometimes I feel like going to the movies, but the seats are just so uncomfortable. And then if you have to get up, you know, and use the restroom, which right now my bladder feels like it's the size of a pea. <laughs> I get it, a pea. <laughs> you know, you're at home, you can pause it and then go back to watching it. Do you guys like going to the movies? Chris's interview ran a little longer than we thought. So I'm going to take his dinner up to him. This is avocado. <gasps> Tonight, before I head up to bed, I'm going to soak Wicket's food with cold water, and then in the morning, it'll be ready. Yeah, but it'll be cold, wet food. He doesn't know. Sit if you want cold. No, you can't do that. You knew he was going to sit. It's like cereal. Let it go. <laughs> now. Baby! Frozen's queued up to watch! You just punched the baby.
No, I didn't. I officially cannot see my feet. I can't see that I'm wiggling my toes. <laughs> I'll be able to rest this on my belly. Like this. And then I can eat. Like that. That was a movie. I give it a two out of ten. Whew. That's cold. And the cold never bothered me anyway. Are you sure we should tell him? Yep. One, two. Thanks again for liking, commenting, subscribing, sharing, and watching even more of our videos right now.